Hi, this is uh, Dr. Brinda Chanappa. I am obstetrician and gynecologist and I practice at Cloud9 Hospital, Jainagar, Bangalore. Preeclampsia, if it happens at the time of maturity, when I say maturity, when the pregnancy is termed beyond 37 weeks, then we deliver the mother and the baby and uh, that should be a happy ending in terms of the mother being well and the baby being well. Preeclampsia, I hope you understand, is where the mother develops very high blood pressure in the pregnancy and it typically happens after 20 weeks of pregnancy. So if this condition happens very early in pregnancy, we tend to control the blood pressure and advance the pregnancy to the extent that we possibly can. Because we want the baby to be mature when it is delivered, we want baby to survive on its own when it, delivered, when it is delivered, we want to avoid prematurity if we can. But there are conditions where the condition of the mother gets very serious and we won't be able to continue the pregnancy because continuing pregnancy may mean risking mother's life. At that point, we will be forced to deliver because ultimately the treatment for preeclampsia is to remove the placenta, which is the trigger for the blood pressure. So to remove the placenta, we have to deliver the baby, no matter what stage of pregnancy we are in, if the mother's life is at risk. So the outcome of the pregnancy, risk to the mother, depends on the stage of pregnancy that she is in. Obviously, if she's quite close to delivery, we'll deliver her and not take any major risk with the mother's life. But if she's so far away from delivery and if, and if you're, say, 26 weeks, then every day inside the uterus means two days outside the NICU, then we will try to push the pregnancy forward. So there will be a risk to the mother's life that we will be taking to a certain extent. And um, again, similarly, the baby that comes out very early goes through a lot of struggle in the NICU. And if it happens even before the way baby is viable, say 24 weeks, then it will not even survive. So these are the risks of uh, preeclampsia on the mother and the baby. This is one of the major conditions that we watch mothers for during any pregnancy. High blood pressure in the mother also doesn't allow the baby to grow well. So these babies can be growth restricted, growth retarded, and they may run into trouble as well, even though the mother is stable, requiring delivery of the baby for its well-being. So the preeclampsia is a difficult scenario and that needs to be watched and monitored and decided on, again, individual basis.